in the paint. That's Williams going underneath Malik McMillan. And there you go, Ben. I... <laughs> this is Cricky along the baseline. High off the glass. Good take by Cricky over Aaron Wheeler. Zaki with the bounce feed. Cricky with the jump shot. Alpo has its first lead. Three coming up and going down for Jacob Ognasevic from the seven foot four giant that Purdue has smashed in the middle. Ognasevic again, another three. Williams against a double team got out of it. Three on the way, and finally one drops for Purdue. So maybe some tired legs early on for Valpo's team in the first couple of games. Williams around Cricky underneath off the glass and good. But we'll learn in situations that are tough, and this is one. You know, down four early, who's going to step up? Williams trying to do it with his hook shot, but the tip goes down from Aaron Wheeler to clean it up. Williams has been busy tonight, goes to the hoop and scores. That's Ognosovic again from the corner, his third three. A little bit of tired legs. Valpo's done a great job of making these bigs uncomfortable. They've doubled, they've made you think, and a great cut by Morton there. They couldn't connect earlier. Down low, Williams around Ignacevic, couldn't get it. Put back, though, goes for Travion Williams. He's in double digits. He put his body, and that's why the rebound fell into his lap. Good look to Stefanovic for three. That's good for Sacha. Thompson, the runner. That rattles through for Isaiah Thompson. Quick spin. Big Ten, the land of bigs, and Travion Williams gets fouled by Donovan Clay. Lottick has to like that. Stefanovic just throws it up and hits. Early in this you know, season, trying to mix up lineups with Eric Hunter. Jaden Ivey out. Williams bounces once, goes up and goes off the glass. Nasovic for three. He's got four of them. That's why he's in there with four fouls. He's been burying threes all night. Williams aggressive in the paint. Couldn't get it to go. Couldn't get his own rebound, but Gillis tracks it down away from Saki. Gillis trying to cut on the back end. Goes off the glass. Feels like it's been forever since it's been a one possession game. And Stefanovic, long three, it's good! Sasha Stefanovic makes it a one-point game! And that's why he's in there right now. Stefanovic rolling through at it, taken away. It's Robinson who picks it up. Clay's on the fast break, finger roll doesn't go. Robinson's put back does. Feeding his first bucket, plus the foul! We talk about him, it's that defense that's going to keep him on the floor in Big Ten play. Yep. Robinson goes through the defense. He tries to move his feet, but it's just not there yet. But that is... Top for Edie! It's easy up there for Edie! Purdue's biggest lead in this game is just three. Thompson can make it five. Yes, he got it to roll at the last possible moment. Apparently had enough practice to get that one to go down. 15 points, 10 rebounds, his 11th career double-double. Three is good for Robinson, and Valpo still in it. Three-point game. Williams 15 and 11 tonight, working on a double-double, working against Cricky. Williams got lost, goes up with the right hand, off the window. Five-point lead for Purdue. Points in the paint, as you'd expect, dominant from Purdue, but two right there for Gordon, who wanted a foul. Poe had an 11-point lead at halftime. Hit a bunch of threes early, but those went away in the second half, and Purdue scrapes out a victory tonight, 68-61 the final at Mackey Arena tonight.